along with Ray Ferraro, who's down at ice level. My name is James Sabalski from way up here high, set to bring you all the action. The Bears can close things out with a win tonight, but how important is it to not think too far ahead, Ray? It's only about tonight, but if you win, you punt them to the curb and you get to get through healthy and rested. Well, we've been waiting for this one all day long, and here we go. This is what you play for. Moments like this, you can feel the energy in this building, and we are underway. Puts it on net, and there's the save. Hershey's moving it up the ice. That's a good heads-up play at center ice. And that pass goes awry. Comes up with the stop as he got a piece of the blocker on it. That's in a dangerous spot. He makes a good save here. Still plenty of time left in this frame. Still looking for our first goal. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. Uses the boards with the bank pass. Urkamps takes it inside his own end. From the neutral zone now. They go on the attack through center. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Hartford's got the puck. Here's a short pass to Nieves. Couldn't find the intended target. Urkamps carries the puck in his own zone. Moves it to Sprong. Hershey's got it into the offensive zone. Battling for it along the boards. Hershey's playing it from the side. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Hershey's gained possession along the boards. Passes it to Pilon. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Scoops up the puck now. Quick pass to Jones. Up the neutral zone now. Pokes the puck away. From the point, looks to make something happen. Play whistle dead because of an offside. Nice job tying up his opponent. Oh, we got a tripping penalty coming up here. The officials were all over that. Let's see the call here. The Wolfpack have put themselves shorthanded, tripping the call. Trying to get to the puck, he reaches his stick right into the guy's feet, and down he goes. Hershey's sending their power play unit out for the first time tonight. Well, to this point, the game is scoreless, and now you've got a real great opportunity with your power play on the ice to get on the board first. That first goal is so critical. Make the opponent chase the game. We're still in the early stages of this period. The game is still scoreless. Nieves wins the draw on their own end. From the right side, they gain the zone. Puts it in deep. The Bears have it now. Sends the pass over. Moves the puck along the half wall. Look out! An easy glove save made by Kincaid. More than half the period left to play. Still scoreless in this one. Hershey's won the faceoff. To the front! Just wide! He's got to do something a little better than that. Just can't finish it from there. Wonder if that gives him a nightmare later. Slides the puck across to Sprong. Great read, comes up with it! Blazing in on the breakaway! Denies him! Oh, excellent stop by the goaltender. He read that perfectly. Puck is cleared out of the defensive zone. Slides it diagonally to Carr. The Bears play it along the wing. Moves it to Carr. Hard hit on the play. Wow, did he ever finish him hard. And when he dropped, he also dropped his stick. Now he's got to collect himself. Looks like a yard sale out there. Sprong's got it in the defensive end. Looking to set up offensively. 
jostles the puck loose. Nice zone entry from the middle. Hershey's got the puck along the wall. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Pass right on the doorstep. Great pad save. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. Kincaid's able to use all the gear here. This is a stick save on the scoring chance. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Across the line and on the attack. The Bears take possession on the defensive end. Want some open space at center. Moves the puck. Whoa! And he scores! Now, the only way he's stopping this one is if it hits him. As soon as the shooter went to shoot it, the goaltender dropped into the butterfly. He's looking around that traffic, hoping he can find it. The Bears take the comfortable position of playing with the lead here, Ray. In the middle chunk of the period, you're looking for momentum to go one way or the other. They've got it now. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Great defensive effort with the stick. Good hit on the play. Sends it across the ice. Couldn't connect on that pass. The Wolfpack have taken possession along the wall. From point blank range. And puts it anywhere but the way he wanted it to go. You can go. Oh, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. Play is blown dead. We've got a penalty on the way. Schilling's going to the box for tripping. His stick gets in between his feet, and when the player goes down, the penalty's going to be called. Hartford's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. They've been running around trying to get this game tied up. They earn a power play, and now they'll have that chance. Quick puck movement always seems to work best for them. Looking to break out here on the power play. Offside is the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the offensive zone. Copley's right on top of this scoring chance. Nowhere for the puck to go. Here in the back half of this period, 1-0 the score. Hershey's won the draw in the neutral zone. Puck picked up in the open ice. Can't connect. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. With the stop, the Bears gain possession of the defensive zone. And a successful clearing attempt. The Wolfpack have possession along the boards. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. Hartford's got the puck along the wall. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Handles the puck. Hershey's penalty killers deliver a huge effort to keep that one goal lead intact. You work so hard to get yourself back in the game, you earn a power play, and then you fail to cash in. So they still trail by one. The game will continue at even strength. Turn that chance aside. Hartford's in now. Snaps it on net. Big chest save as he gobbled that one up with the trapper. The setters will glide into the dot. Hartford's won the draw. Quick feed to Brodzinski. Takes it right in the chest. And there's the whistle giving him a chance to exhale. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. The Wolfpack have it on the attack. The Bears get a hold of the puck along the boards. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. Hartford's got it in their own zone. Takes the feed. Brzezinski's picking up steam. Handles the puck from the left side. Right in front of the net, and that's picked off. 
Across the line from center. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Up along the wing. Receives the pass. Hershey's got the puck in their own end. Here they come. And they fail to go take to take. Nice pass. Centering pass! Off the outside of the post and stays out. The Bears let out a collective groan here on the bench beside me as that puck rings off the pipe and stays out. The Wolfpack have gained possession off the wall. Puck battle along the boards. Grabs it in his own end. The Bears move it ahead. Fontaine's got it along the boards. Looks to get the puck over to Thompson. Great heads up play in the defensive zone. The Bears are on the attack. Here's a chance out front. Scores! One thing to score in the regular season. Now you get to where the money's all sitting there. The playoff games are super intense, and he's on the board. This drives coaches crazy. Everybody's staring at the player behind the net. He's only dangerous if you turn the net around. The dangerous guy's in front of the net. Oh, yeah, he's the guy that scored. Here in the later stages of this period, Hershey's really controlled the pace of play these last few minutes, leading by two. Center's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. The Wolfpack have taken possession in their own end. Couldn't complete the play. He grabs the puck here at the point. Right in the slot! That pass doesn't go. The Wolfpack have the puck in their own zone. Gaining momentum along the wing. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. And they can't finish that one. Oh, he's going to be kicking himself for that. The play was there. He just doesn't execute that last pass for the scoring opportunity. Keeps hold of the puck. Grabs it in his own end. Slides the puck over. Sends it across. Here's a shot. Stones him with the blocker. Oh, that's a good save. When we get a second look at this, you see how quickly the shooter delivers the puck to the net. The centermen glide into position. The Bears win the draw. Takes the feed. Hershey's got the puck in the defensive end. Nice dish from the left wing. Skates to the crease. He tried to go high, but it goes off the crossbar and then off the post. He's so disappointed he was shaking his head as he saw this up on the big board. That's a really good shot. He just hits a crossbar. Winding down the final minute of this opening frame. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Scores! You get one, you get hungry for a second one. Even if you're not a goal scorer, you get that early. Now you want to hunt for a second goal. Makes it a double on the play. The goalie's probably got to stop this, but I don't think he's set, James. That turnover didn't give him much time to get set in the net. Here in the late going of the frame, Hershey's been showing relentless pressure lately, now up by three. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Scored by number 50, Mason Moran. Hartford's got a hold of it against the wall. Couldn't complete the play. Couldn't make that one happen. On the attack along the boards. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. There's the horn. You could have replaced it with a white flag based on the score of this one after the first 20. Hey, fans, don't forget to find those draw boxes throughout the arena for our starting jersey, which we will give away tonight.
As both teams get a breather here in this first intermission, we'll do the same and get ready for period number two. Along with Ray Ferraro between the benches, I'm James Sabolski. Period number two is about to get underway. A one-sided affair after the first 20 minutes. Here we go for period number two. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Hartford's got the puck against the boards. Aaron pass, and the play's broken up. Denies him! He got off! Lots of time left in this period. Hershey's got a 3-0 lead. They have been in control right from the start. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Here's a chance. Misses a golden opportunity there. Sends a pass over. Hershey's in transition. Moves it around along the half wall. Hartford's looking to break out of their own end. Manages to hang on. From the left side, they gain the zone. Slides it across. Back to the blue line. Let's it fly from the point. Denies him on the slapper. Hershey's got the puck along the boards. Moves it quickly over to Pilon. Here's a backhander. Stones him in front. Dead center. Excellent save. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. Hershey's got a hold of it along the wall. Slides the puck across. And now he moves it quickly to Bronsinski. From the left side, it moves to the middle of the ice. The Bears have it against the wall. Hershey's got the puck. And he slides it quickly to Carr. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Here's a short pass to Sprong. Hershey's got the puck against the half wall. Chance right in front, and that's blocked. Hartford's looking to break out. Inside the offensive zone. To his teammate. Makes the save as he got a blocker on it. Copley's goaltending at one end, and the offensive output at the other has made for a good night. Puck scooped up by Brzezinski. Hartford's moving it along the wing. And he regains control of the puck. Stays with it. Takes a shot. Gets in front of it. Pretty good shot. The goalie's able to get the blocker up on it and put it outside. Hartford's look good offensively to this point, but they continue to trail here in the second. Offense is on face-off, and he wins the draw. Quick pass to Thompson. Hartford's on the attack. No one home on that play. Gains the zone from the right side. Hartford's gained possession along the boards. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Drives to the paint. Denies that opportunity. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Hartford's ready to go on the attack. Schilling's moving it ahead. Can't hang on to the puck after the play. Reads the pass perfectly and picks it off. Hershey's got it along the wall. That's wide of the net. Just misses the net, but really the scoring chance is not dangerous if you can't get the puck at the goaltender. Hartford's got it against the boards. The Bears gain control of the puck against the wall. Takes the pass. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Scrum ensues along the boards. Puck knocked loose in the neutral zone. Maintains possession. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Here's a shot, and that's turned aside with a glove. Handles it along the blue line. Rocked him in the open ice. 
Hershey's got it along the wall. Hangs onto the puck. Puts it up front. Wrestling in close. Blocker save. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. Hershey's got the puck along the wall. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Moves it to Brodzinski. A chance! Stopped by the goaltender. Hey, Brannigan, one more time. Let's roll that. This becomes a dead end in a hurry. Watch how he lays the shoulder right there. That's a big hit. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. Hershey's on easy street right now. They lead it 3-0. Puck grabbed by Brzezinski. Takes a shot. Just wide to the net. The Bears scoop it up along the boards. Stretch pass. Love the way he moved that puck up quickly. Along the side. Here they come through the neutral zone. Takes a shot. Gobbles the puck up there with the chest. Hartford's had a lot of good looks on net, but they continue to trail here in the second. Jones has it in their own end. Jostling for the puck, and it's knocked away. With possession along the wall. Here's a shot denied by the goaltender. Takes control of the puck. Taken by Sprong. And we've got a two-on-one. Big save. The Wolfpack have taken possession along the wall. Loose puck battle along the boards. Hershey's got possession at center. Tries to get the puck to the Evans. Move to the middle. Chris one. He scores. So is this the time the coach says the two-goal leads the most dreaded lead in hockey? Oh, yeah. Somebody's going to say it. Guaranteed down there. But now you're only down two. You've got to push the play, take some chances, get up the ice. You've got to get another one. I don't think the goaltender gets a look at this at all, James. He just drops into the butterfly. He's hoping the thing hits him through that traffic. The Wolfpack have got back to the face-off circle and probably feeling yep. a little bit better now. Well, for much of the game, James, they've been out to lunch, but now at least they're back within two. You can start believing again. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Grabs the puck. Assisted by number 15. Takes the feed up ahead. From the right side and up the middle. Pinned up along the boards. The Bears gain possession along the wall. Hartford's got control of the puck. Straight up the middle. Here they come. Along the half wall with the puck. Let's the wrister fly. No room for that one to get through. At center ice now. He grabs the puck. They've got numbers. Sends it over. And they can't convert to the play. Sends the pass over. Let's it go. Nothing. The Bears get a hold of the puck along the boards. Hartford's got it now. And that one stopped. Hartford's had a lot of good looks offensively, but they have run into one hot goaltender, which is why they trail late in this second. The Bears win the draw. Schilling's taking it from his own end. Puck picked up by Johansson. And he'll take a step back here deep inside his own zone. Moves the puck. Move to the middle. Tees him up and puts it wide in the cage. Man, it tells you how close it can be. If that's two inches to the other side, it's off the post and in. Getting into the later stages of this period, Hershey's got a 3-1 lead as they have dominated for the most part in this. Hartford's won the draw, and they'll go to work. He scores! Well, I like the way they stayed aggressive here, James. After scoring once, they didn't just settle the game down. They went after it again. We'll get another look at this, James, and 
I thought it might have been deflected, but that's clean by the goalie. He just gets a little piece of it. Hartford's got one back late in the second. How does that change things now, Ray? From their bench, it seems like they're pretty excited. They jumped up, they're loud, they're ready to go as they try to find the equalizer. Fontaine's got it in the defensive zone. Thompson's gaining momentum. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Handles the puck. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. Hershey's got a hold of it against the wall. The Bears are in transition. The Wolfpack have the puck in the defensive zone. On the attack along the boards. That goes wide. Hershey's got the puck along the boards. The Bears will play it from the defensive zone. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. Trying to get back on the attack now. We got a penalty coming up here on the play. The Bears carry it along the wall. Sends it down low. From point blank, denies it in front. Move it to the middle. Shot. And there's the whistle stopping the play. Let's see who's off to the box. The Wolfpack have been handed a two-minute penalty for holding. Pretty tough to argue when you've got your hand wrapped around the guy's arm. Penalty for holding. Hershey's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Well, here's another power play, James. They haven't been very good so far tonight. Nothing to show for their previous attempts. So now you have to get back to it, adjust, and re-attack on this man advantage. They get it out of the defensive end. We got a delayed call coming up here as the referee raises his hand. Into the middle of the neutral zone. And the goaltender gets to the bench for the extra attacker. And the officials stop the play. Let's see what the call is. Boarding the call, was it aggressive or just loud? Sometimes I think it's just loud. It looks like a good hit a lot of times. Sometimes, though, you can just smell that's a penalty. Hershey's got a five on three, and the clock's their BFF here. The Bears win the faceoff. Shuts them down. Really smooth stop here as he deflects this puck into the corner out of danger. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Up, he flares up the arm with the blocker. Makes a pretty good save here. Hartford's had plenty of good looks offensively, but they have been snake bitten as they trail late in this second period. That's a smart read with the two centermen tied up. Puck clears the zone. And there's the horn ending period number two. Boy, no shortage of offense here. During the game, please remember to be alert at all times in our seating area. Even with the hand safety measures, there are moments when a puck can be propelled into the spectating area with enough force to cause injury. So please stay alert at all times when the game is in play. The third period is just around the corner. Ray and I will bring you all the action in a moment.
The moment of truth has arrived for both these teams. Third period action set to go. Here we go. Put up or shut up for both teams here in this third period. We are underway. Ray Ferraro is between the benches at ice level. Ray, we've got 40 minutes played so far. How have you viewed things? Hartford's game plan really can't change or shouldn't change too much. They've owned time of possession. They've had the puck a lot. They just haven't been able to catch the game. Levels them with the hit. Takes the feed. Fails to find the open man. Referee singling the late penalty. Looks like hooking will be the call. The Bears fail to capitalize on the man advantage. Both sides back to even strength. This is a good old-fashioned hooking the call here. He looked like he was water skiing. Man, you got to move your feet. You get your stick around his waist, you'll get called. Another special teams opportunity for both sides as the man advantage unit is back to work again. Even though this is a great chance to tie the game, you still have to remain a little bit patient. Don't panic with the puck. And they manage to clear it. The Wolfpack have the puck against the boards. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Here's a chance, and it doesn't get much better than that. Oh, he's in a great spot to score, but he misses the net over top. And they move the puck out of harm's way. Hartford's got it from behind the net. Enters the offensive zone from the left. Quick snap! He scores! Well, they've been hoping that the extra work they've done on the power play would help them capitalize. You do a nice job there. effective power play there they move the puck around and they're able to find him right in the middle of the slot lots of time left in this period we got a tie game Hershey's won it Grabs the puck at center. And loses possession after a solid hit. Hartford's got it in their own zone. Takes it and looks ahead. The Bears get a hold of the puck in the open ice. Hartford's looking to break out of their own end. Takes the feed. You saw the lane there, James. That's a good pass. Hammers a shot! Not even close! Not close to anything. The net's been the same size for a hundred years. The Bears move to the offensive zone. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Hartford's got a hold of the puck. They've got the defense outnumbered. The Bears have it against the wall. From his own end, he picks up the puck. The Wolfpack have it now. Hartford's got the puck against the boards. The Bears will play it in their own end. Can't find his man. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on. Puts it in for the go-ahead goal. Control the game now. You finally got the lead. You worked so hard to get in front. Don't give it up now. I like how quickly he got this puck off his stick in the high slot. He moved around, find some clean ice, and then beat the goaltender. The Wolfpack have been the better team tonight. Now they finally have the lead that proves it. And we'll see how they play the rest of the game. I'd like them to play the same way. Be ready for the push that will come from your opponent, but still try to dictate the play. Takes a shot, and that one's turned away. Chaps the puck away. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Receives the pass. Takes the cross ice pass. Hershey's gained possession along the boards. Schilling's got it across the line. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. 
Shepherds moving it up the ice. Here they are on the attack. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Let's it go from the slot. Scores! Now that shot beats him, but man, there's so much traffic in front of the net. He's trying to dip and dive around the players. He never finds the puck. Hartford's been the better team tonight. They have turned good defense into solid offense, and they lead here in the third. This neutral zone faceoff set to go, and we are back underway. Hershey's got a hold of it along the wall. Dumps it in. Here he is in front. Comes up with a big puts it in for the goal, and the rookie is on the board. What a nice way to jump into your first playoff year. You get on the board, and you can relax a bit. I always have zero sympathy for the goalie. That's a tough break. Bad break for him, you bet. But the puck goes into the net after somehow it's funneled that way and it bounces around into the cage. The Bears have got a big one here in the third now. Well, you got to be careful that the clock melts away fast on you, but now they've got a chance. Hershey's got a hold of the puck off the draw. Fires it into the offensive zone. The Wolfpack have possession along the boards. Looking for space inside the D zone. Moves the puck along the half wall. Can't maintain possession after that hit. Big play inside the defensive zone. Putting the hard hat on here. What a hit. And they'll dump it in. Hartford's got it behind the net. Nice pass. The Bears take possession in the defensive end. Hershey's across the blue line. Tries to feed it across. Keeps hold of the puck. Snaps one on net, and that one's blocked. Passes on over to Pilon. Oh, rocked along the boards. I almost feel the boards rattle where I'm standing here, James. That's a solid hit. Nice poke check. Can't catch up to the pass. Hershey's got the puck here in the open ice. Gaining momentum along the wing. The Bears gain control of the puck against the wall. Oh, we got a penalty coming up as you can see that he was slowed down on the play. Up the neutral zone now. Into the attacking area from the left side. Hartford's got the puck along the wall. And there's the whistle stopping the play. Here's the official call. And the official signaling for hooking on the play. You gotta move your feet here. You're chasing the play. As soon as you stop your feet, you're gonna get called. Back to the face-off circle. They'll send the man advantage unit out again. When we talked to both coaches, they talked about how important the power play was. What I like about this team, though, they've already scored, and they look like they're hungry for more. the puck over takes it to the net and makes the save save made by the goalie after the first stop he's in good position to make a second pumps the puck away here's a blast denies him with a save Copley's gonna hang on for a whistle here in the third well there's not much time left here as you get into the final 20 minutes the game's close a mistake now would be critical past the midway mark of the frame We've got a 5-4 game. Hartford's got it in the offensive zone. Just wide. The Bears scoop it up along the boards. Quick feed to Brodzinski. Stopped by the goaltender. Copley's going to hang on and just let things settle down for a moment. He really didn't have many options to play the puck, but no. in a close game, you want to be sure every time you do. Hartford's got the edge in the shot department, a big reason why they lead here in this third period. Gets a hold of the puck. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. Centering pass! And that one's broken up. Great block there. 
Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Jones looks around. Shot! Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Oh, he snaps the glove save off there. Excellent chance in the slot. A big face-off here inside the offensive end. Hartford's got it, and they're on the attack. Oh, denies him with the save! I think he got the blocker on it! And a poke check knocks the puck away. Centering pass, and he can't find his man. Grabs the puck here inside the offensive end. Hershey's playing it from the side. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Hartford's got it in their own zone. Across the line. The Bears gain possession along the wall. Through center. Gains the zone through center. Here's a shot. Simple glove save by Kincaid. Now we'll get another look at this. That's a good shot, but the goalies get the blocker up to make the save. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. Nice job tying up his opponent. And that puck leaves the zone. Steps inside the line. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. Takes the feed in the middle of the neutral zone. Moves it quickly over to Nieves. Pokes it away in his own end. Sent in deep, and they'll go off for a change. Here's a short pass to Fontaine. Make a change, make a change. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. They go on the attack from the left side. Quick pass to Nieves. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Hershey's got a hold of it against the wall. Good use of the body to knock them off the puck. Steps into all of that. The Bears pick up the puck here in the neutral zone. Johansson's got it in the defensive end. Hershey's got the puck along the wall. Nearing the final minute of regulation. Dumps it into the ozone. Hartford's got the puck in the defensive end. Pumps it away here in the neutral zone. Fontaine's got the puck now at his own end. Takes a couple of knocks and loses control. The Bears have pulled the goaltender here. They've got the extra attacker out on the ice in hopes of a goal. Puck battle along the boards. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Jostles for the puck but still hangs on. Brzezinski stick handling in his own zone. Through center along the wing. And that pass goes awry. Handles the pass from the right side. Cuts to the front. Whoa. They tied it up. They tied it up. Well, right beside me, their bench just sprung to their feet. The guys are banging their sticks on the board. They are so happy. I think they all thought the game was gone. Well, that worked up just about as you draw it. You get the goalie out of the net. You get pressure to the net. And now you're able, with the extra man, to capitalize. The setters will glide into the dot. Hartford's won the draw in the neutral zone. Moves it around along the half wall. Takes a shot. Makes the save. The arms up. There's the whistle. And boy, look at the time here for a penalty coming up. Urkamps may not like it, but a pretty cut and dry call for the officials for holding. He's trying to slow him up, trying to impede his progress a little bit, but he gets too much of a grab, and now he'll go to the box. Hartford's got a huge opportunity on this power play. Takes the feed. Quick shot, and gets a piece of him with the trapper. That's a pretty good scoring chance. That's a chance the shooter thinks might go in, but the goalie turns it aside.
Here's the shot, and he comes up with it. Regulation time comes to an end. That means we've got some overtime coming up. Everything old is new again. If you wear your vintage jersey to our next game, you'll receive a coupon for a free burger. Ray and I will take a quick breather with OT coming up next. the hero will there be a zero overtime set to go Hartford's power play is still intact as this period is now underway and they take possession Hershey's got possession while undermanned and a few players scrambling for cover as the puck sailed a little too close for their liking this is a face-off they'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone The Bears win the draw. A chance to get it out. And mission accomplished, Ray. Yeah, late in the game, it's defensive blue line, puck out. Offensive blue line, puck in. Nothing turned over at those two spots. Copley's going to opt for the whistle and give everybody a chance to breathe. Sometimes you get running around as the shift gets long. This helps. A critical draw here. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Made the stop on the play. Wow. He scores! It is over! And that's all she wrote on this one as we are in the books. Ray, you've been a playoff OT winner before yourself. What does this do for a team to get an OT winner? You go back in the locker room, there is such a high, such a rush of adrenaline. You can't wait to get back out there and play the next game. That's a huge goal for them to stay in the series. Another reason why we love playoff hockey. For Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Good night.